G'day again and welcome back to Fields of Fire Volume 1, Second Mission, the Cerisi Offensive. We are up to turn 5. We've just successfully survived, through pure luck, a uh, enemy counter-attack. Uh, the only thing that saved us is that we were already at um, heavily engaged, where we still remain. Okay, so first things first, I've reshuffled the deck since we finished it at the end of last turn, and we go for the higher headquarters event, where there is none. So the CO gets three commands. Okay, that takes him up to five. Let's see what we want to do with him. So the CO is currently sitting here in the gully, my plant, Excuse me. My plan is still to get him and the uh, Arty Ford Observer up into here to the farm. My worry is if I move him up there now, the sniper could potentially take him out, and I don't really want that. So, what to do? So I'm going to leave him there for the time being. Um, he is simply going to pop off his Red Star Cluster. Oof, like that. And that way, these units here will stop firing. Do, 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 do. Uh, what have I been doing here? I think I've been putting all the kind... Yeah, I'm an idiot. Oh, I've been mixing up. Okay, that's fine. I can sort that in my own time. Okay, so the VOF goes away as well. Um, and that's that. So the CO has popped his Red Star Cluster for one, and that's all he's going to do. He's finished. Um, no, he's not finished. Oh, hang on. No, I don't want to set up the casualty clearing point this far back. I'd really like to set it up in the farm um, or further forward into the attack position, the assault position up there in the woods. Righto. So CO is going to give three platoon... Uh, sorry, he's going to activate three platoon. That leaves the CO with three. And he is going to activate one platoon as well. That leaves him with two commands banked. Righto, so I'll just come over here. So one platoon will receive three commands. And I'm going to try and get them forward now. Um... In fact, I'm going to get two platoon done as well, sorry. Because I'm going to have to move two platoon before I can move one platoon. Okay, two platoon will get three commands. And three platoon, again, lucky draw, we'll get five. Right here. Oh, let's come back and play. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to do a platoon move with two platoon up to here. Can I pick them all up? Nah, too hard. Okay, finger time. There we go. Okay, so that's two commands for the platoon move forward, which leaves five at the moment. He is going to move 2AT forward. Now, can we do a cheeky? Yep. Okay, we're going to move 2AT forward on to the sniper's card. Okay, so the sniper will automatically change his PDF to him. I 
which will be a sniper, small arms, and he is engaged, uh, sorry, exposed. Um, what was I doing? Up there. Okay, so that's one more. So two platoon has now got four left. Next thing two platoon is going to do is they're going to try and do a spotting move onto the sniper. So a draw of one. No good. So he's going to ask one of two to do the check. And again, no good. He has two left. Who else has he got here? He's done it. One of two's done it. He's going to ask two of two to have a look. And they're useless as well. Which leaves one more, and he's going to ask three of two to have a look. And three of two, because they had all the time in the world to actually have a look around, spots the sniper. Okay. Uh, that's a B. Okay, so now we do have a two-way street here with small arms to begin with. Right, that makes me feel betterish. So he is now under fire. Okay, and two platoon has no commands to save. Right up. Let's come down here to one platoon. So one platoon now is going to do a platoon move forward. Out of there. And they're going to come straight forward into here, into the woods. They are going to be exposed. So that's two. That leaves them three. They are going to try and rally this fire team. Uh, hang on one. Okay. They are going to try and rally this. No, they're not. They're going to try and rally this litter team. So we get two. Good. We are rallied on the first and rallied on the second. Okay, so the litter team, we'll get rid of, becomes a fire team. As such. And then we're going to try and rally this fire team to an assault team. So we've got two left. And we go nothing. And we go, nothing. Um, so... He's still pinned, so that's fine. Um, and that will do. So he's got one to save. Okay, three platoon is over here. And we have this assault team. And we have the rest of three platoon here. Okay. Da, 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 okay. Three platoon is going to move. Uh, no, they're not. Not at the moment, they're not. So first thing three platoon is going to do is try and get three mortar to chuck a grenade in here. So draw of two. First one is successful and the second one was blank. Okay, so that's another successful grenade. I mark that on my list and that's three mortar. Beautiful. Okay, so they've done that. Um, and because it was successful, then I'm going to move 
the assault team forward. Because if it had been unsuccessful, then it would have affected me as well. So, okay, so that's two. They've got three left. Um, what to do? And that's all they're going to do, I think. Yep. So they'll bank those last three, which is wonderful. Okay. So XO gets one. First sergeant gets one. So XO is here. Excuse me. Okay, EXO and Mortarford Observer are going to move straight forward uh, along with the CO there. So that's two, which leaves him with one saved command. Uh, and the Sergeant has really got nowhere to go at the moment. Um, could move up to here, could move, in fact, sorry, I'm just going to backtrack a bit. Um, three platoon is going to do a platoon move forward. So they've got one command left now. So they're actually going to come up into here. And they are exposed. Sorry. Okay. So then the sergeant is going to activate the jeep for one and that gives him one command saved as well. Righto, general initiative is for two. So let's see what we've got here. Um, okay, so we've got this poor gent here is under fire. So I'm going to try and get him under cover. So draw a four, and we have contact for one, rally for two, cover for three, and reshuffle for four. Okay, so he is now exposed under cover, which gives him a little bit of something, which is great. Okay, so that's one. Now the second one that he is going to do after the shuffle is he is physically going to fire off a grenade. So just make check. Uh, 280, yep. Just so I know who's doing it. Okay. So 280, firing off a grenade. And draw of two, and we have a one for nothing, and we have a two for nothing. So we have a miss, which affects both of them. So at least um, he's no worse off because the cover that he got will alleviate that one. Okay, so that's the end of the Americans' turn. Uh, so it is the Germans, and we're looking for a high HQ event, and there is none. So now we're going to look at their um, activity phase. So we have this one who has an activity phase. We have this one who has an activity phase. This one and that one. And that's it. Okay, so one, two, three, four. We already know that he's fired his one mission. So he is going to run away. That's the Arty Ford Observer. Uh, sorry, Arty Spotter goes away again because he's fired his one mission down here again. So forget about him. Um, the Spotter's going to do his own thing. And that, if I remember correctly, is he is going to 
run away. Uh, sniper, 53. Okay. Uh, once the sniper is spotted, you must move a good order sniper one card away from any friendly units during each activity check until it is out of friendly line of sight or has exited the map. Okay. So, for him, he has to move until he is one until he is out of line of sight of friendly units. Well, his only friendly units are here now. Um, so moving out of line of sight of this unit is the only one he needs to worry about. He could be seen here or he could be seen here. So therefore he's going to go to either here, here or here. Um, and I believe he's going to go to the highest uh, cover that he can, which is a three plus here in the church or a 3 plus here in the village, so we'll just call them 1 and 2 and he's going to go to 2, so he's going to run over to the village and he will be, I'll just leave that there, sorry PDF stays he is exposed which would be really nasty if it's winter um, so my PDF will stay here because I'm a goose. I didn't see him run away. His PDF will come... Ah, now. He's not silly, is he? Um, now, he has moved, but it says that he will remain firing into, oh, into the same. So he's going to fire into here still. Uh, okay, so that goes back up there. Um, and again, it's still the sniper, small arms fire, and I get the grenade miss against my bloody self. Right. Um, that goes on there, that goes on there like that. Uh, but he is seen still by these ones here. So that's good. So hopefully next time he'll go off the map and we can forget about him for a while. Righto. So what do we have left? We have this potential contact here and we have this potential contact here. So one and two. And we're going to do number one. So he is a potential contact undercover. Oh, he's not a lat. So... On same card as a US unit, yep, and undercover. So it's a one for no action, or a two or three for a grenade attack. So it's a three, so he's going to try a grenade attack. First one, unsuccessful. Second one, unsuccessful. So we have a grenade miss, which affects everybody. Which leaves us with this one now. And yeah. He is pinned. Pinned undercover. I moved him forward, so let me just fix this. Uh, I moved him forward, so therefore. I didn't pop that smoke I was going to do, did I? I'm a dickhead. Yeah. Okay, well, we're still shooting in there, uh, but he would stop shooting over there and he would be shooting at moi. So that would be for all pinned here. Um, but I think he's now affected by everybody else's firing as well, which is a pain in the bottom. Okay, so he is pin da, 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 undercover on a US card. So it's a one through five. And he gets a five. And a five is fallback. Right on. So he's going to fall back out of line of sight if possible. 
So he can't fall back here because he'll still be in line of sight of this one. Um, he can fall back here, but he's going to be in line of sight of both. Or he can try and fall back here, where he's only then in line of sight of this one. So let's see what's over there. And we have a hedgerow. Okay, so this is the 2+, plus. so I think this is where he's actually going to go to. So he's going to be exposed. Comes out of his foxholes. Goes over there. Uh, that stays there. Oops, sorry. Uh, this is just his PDF now, coming back over. It's not all pinned anymore, which is a pain in the bot bot as well. He goes back to automatic weapons fire into here. Um, which I don't need to worry about at the moment because we've already got one there with the crossfire, which is going to affect me and the grenade, which I'm the only person there now. But the grenade was fired on there, so it's not going to affect me. But we now have a potential contact, I believe. Righto. So that's all of them. Um, well, we're starting to push them back, but um, yeah, they're starting to hurt us as well. Okay, so that was the enemy activity check. And we are done which leads us to the capture phase. Okay, so I have a fire team here. Can he do that? Capture any paralyzed or liver team alone on the card with an infantry unit with a VOF rating. Well, there's no VOF rating, but it's just a casualty. Uh... If side does not take them, turn them to casualties. Otherwise, designate guards and remove guard and prisoner. Well, he's casualty. So I don't remove him. We'll just take him off there. We got him. That's the main thing. Okay. Now, we retreat any non-pin, non-captured, paralyzed teams. Okay. We have nothing here, we have nothing here, we have nothing here. Non-pinned, non-paralyzed, we have nothing here, nothing here, no, 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 no. Uh, it's mutual, so do they have any non-pinned, non-captured, no, no. No. Okay. So then the mutual vehicle phase, and we simply bring... Uh, yep. We bring the vehicle up to the farm. It's moved and fired, and it is now exposed. Righto. So, update fire missions. So... This fire mission now goes away, which was wonderful. Um, evaluate potential contact markers. So we have this one here. And we have, I think, that one there. And that is the only two that I'm aware of. And they are both Bs. So we'll simply go one, two. And we're going to do number one first. Okay. So it's a B at heavily engaged still, because we still have these units here, uh, which is a draw of two. And we have a blank. And we have cover. Right on. So that comes away. And that comes away. And all we have now is this one for, again, a draw of two. And we have cover again. And we have cover. 
again. Okay. So again, very lucky. Right. T O. So that's potential compacts. Uh, combat effects. Right. So we have nobody under fire here. Uh, remove blah, 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 for each card with a PC marker and a friendly unit draw da 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 da. No, hang on. Combat effects. For any pin vehicle or infantry on a card without a VOF, remove the pin marker. So we can remove the pin marker from there. Uh, we have a VOF there. <laughs> uh, nothing there. Uh, we have a VOF and we have a VOF. Okay, so that's done. Righto. So who is under fire? He is not under fire, but he is. No, they are both under fire. Ah, uh, sorry, he's not under fire. We haven't spotted him yet, but he is. Um, they are not under fire. <laughs> he's under fire. Um, but he's not at the moment. Okay, so one for them to attack first. Two, we're going to attack first. So the only ones that we have to attack are... Uh, I'm an idiot. None! No, we're not attacking any bugger, are we? No, we're not. So that means what we'll do is we'll call that uh, two... Oh, we've got three. So what was the three on that card? It was a three anyway. Okay, so we've got one, two, three, so we're just going to go here first. Okay. He is exposed for minus two. Under automatic weapons fire for minus three. In a crossfire for minus four. With the grenade going off there, which doesn't affect us. Plus two. So he's at minus two being hit by his own fire as well, and minus two is a hit, and he is a line unit, so he is a casualty. Friendly fire, no such thing. A uh, casualty, sorry. Doo, doo, doo. There we go. So exposed marker can go away. Right. Then we have one and two, and we're going to do number two this time. Okay, so we have this. So he's pinned for plus one. With automatic fire is minus one, so that's even. He has a minus one grenade, plus one, so he's at zero. And he is hit as a line unit and becomes a casualty, just for the fun of it. Okay, so two mortar goes there, and becomes, hmm, that's a good one, a casualty. So don't worry about the pin marker anymore. Um, don't worry about that anymore. Righto, so let's just have this one up here now. Again, who's going to cop? A shellacken. So, he is exposed under cover. So that's minus two plus one is minus one. He has a sniper attack, which is minus three. So we're at minus four. We have a miss grenade, which takes him up to minus five. Um, and we have a plus two, so he's at minus three. And a minus three is strange. It's a hit. And he is a line unit for minus three. Yeah, so he is now a paralyzed unit. So let's get rid of that. <laughs> get rid of that. Bring the paralyzed unit over, under cover, and Sorry, and pinned. Righto. 
So actually now there is, he's still got to take a hit because of this missed grenade, I believe. So he's plus one, minus one, which is zip, plus one. So being plus one, it is a miss. So that was fine. Okay. <clears throat> so he's cleared me off there, so I'm going to get rid of that. Righto. So clear up. We have an exposed marker, which can go. We have an exposed marker and an exposed marker. We have automatic weapons fire, a grenade missed. Oops. So where is he going to aim now? He could aim in here or he could aim in here. They're both plus twos. Um, or he can aim in here, because this is only a plus one. So he's going to go there. Because they have less cover. Now let's just check that bit at the moment. Okay, so that's all done there. And get a casualty. What else have we got? Cluster, star cluster goes. All right, that's used. Okay, so that's good, that's good, that's good, that's good, that's good. Over here, nothing happening. Over here, the grenade goes. Uh, I don't know why there was a PDF there still, probably because I'm just lucky like that. Um, so we still have automatic weapons coming in here. We still have automatic weapons coming in here. Well, not really, because he has got nobody to shoot at. So that PDF will go away. Um, so there is no crossfire anymore. Sorry. Um, we still do have the he heavy machine gun firing into here so we need to stop that next turn um, okay him remove his exposed marker he has no line of sight to anybody else at the moment so hopefully he'll run away next time okay now coming up to here we still have the sniper fire coming in from this unexposed now. Um, the grenade miss goes. Uh, Foxholes are still there. We still have the PDF going in. The only PDF we have now, though, is Zip. There is no PDF because he is a lat paralyzed team. Uh, so we have that small arms can go away as well. And I think that's about that. So, thank you very much. Uh, that's the end of turn five, and I'll look forward to seeing you for turn six. Catch you later.